what they go do with me now. I'm still a talk of the town. Don't need assistance, I'm poking them down. We turn the smiles into frowns. Gang hop out, then we clear in the crowd. Say this shit every song, and I never got shot in my head with y'all on. These bitches be bucking, these bitches be wop. Hey, yo, Tati, we know you a thot. Alright, so hey guys, we're on a new episode of Talk of the Town. Today we have a special guest. Nah, nigga, what's going on? <laughs> I know who it is, bro. It's the so for people that don't know or or, or is unfamiliar with Sugar Hill, tell us like what that's like, where that's at. How would you explain that? I mean, that's in Harlem. You heard? I said, I said, I said, dangerous. Oh, uh, you heard? Like niggas, niggas don't want to go there. We, we them niggas. You feel me? Like we top ops. We do shit. So you grew up in um, Sugar Hill your whole life. Mm -hmm. So like, how did so so everybody you know you kind of like met growing up. Like y'all y'all been to each other? Like who like who? Like you and Edi and D. Oh, yeah, and that's my that's my baby boy. Everybody. And um is it more artists coming from Sugar Hill or Yeah. My son Sugar Hill D dot slow bro, my son. My son uncup my son uncupping artists and shit, man. So my son go be there. Okay, so how did you get into music for real for real? I ain't gonna lie, I was playing with this shit. I used to like since since my son thought you know, I started this shit since he kicked the doors down, since war cry for me, I just be for me chilling, just being patient and shit for me. Mm hmm Shit like that. But you was still working on music at that time? No. So when did you like get in the booth and was like, yeah, I'm about to like go go do this? I ain't gonna lie. I went to call it and my son ate. Mm -hmm. Okay and shit. And then niggas just, my son ate just told me to get in the booth and shit. That's when I made the move, look at shit. Gangsta. And how long ago was that? Like four or five months ago. Six, five months ago, I think. So four, five, six months ago. So with the um with the move look song though, you was promoting now on TikTok. How did the idea of that song come about? I ain't gonna lie. I be geeking, you heard? <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, I'm sturdy, I be geeking, bro. Gangsta, bro. I already started this sturdy shit, bro. Gangsta. Not everybody getting sturdy and shit, bro. Niggas mm -hmm. know who started this shit, bro. Gangsta. Bro. So like, do you feel like um your friends around you definitely motivated you to um was you like learning I guess being around them yeah so like being with E dot being with Shaw and what what would you say you learned I guess getting into music being with them and stuff like that I ain't gonna lie I'm like I don't know how to say it but like just being around them niggas like for me especially my son Dot for me my son kicked the, my son kicked down the doors and this whole shit for me so. Me being around him, like, his fans seeing me and shit for me, like, know who I am and shit, like, uh -huh. shit like that. And then I just started rapping. Uh, grew up. So people was, like, really, really jacking y'all. The three of y'all, y'all did the touch the ground. That was, like, over M, but it had got taken down. How'd you uh, feel about it when it got taken down? Insta, niggas be hating, bro. Insta. I don't know, bro, niggas be hating, bro. Who took that down? Fuck, that should just keep me going, bro. Motivation, bro. Just keep keep dropping that fire, bro. So you wasn't bothered when um when it got um taken down? Nah, I was bad. You said? Yeah, I was bad. I seen you was you was on live. You made a diss track. <laughs> so so you feel like you feel like it was Cardi B part. Cardi B's the reason why I got taken down, or you just was in the ba in your bag that day and you was like. I think I think it was that bitch. Oh wow. <laughs> I don't think it was. It probably was label stuff. Oh, no, I don't I think know. It was hard on so, are you gonna release that track, or you don't know? Yeah, soon. He <laughs> said, like, yeah, soon, 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 soon. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So, like, so your creative process. So, what's this like? What it's like when you in the studio? I mean, I'm me, or gangster, like, I move, look, I get in that booth. It's always just a vibe, bro. Ah, <laughs> shit, be. I begin. I get in that move, bro. I feel like, bro, if move look was in a dictionary, though, like, how would you, what would it say? Like, what would that mean? Can't talk too much. <laughs> so, just dope. Just know, okay. So, um, so you drop, you've been dropping like nonstop. You did the Cupid. Uh, the, you did the Cupid song, but that beat was like kind of like a Jersey type of sound. So like. Are you gonna tap into that sound more? Are you gonna do more drill shit? Like, how do you go nah, about picking Jersey's, your beats? Jersey's, 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 Jersey's drill beat. That's yeah. me right there. So you gonna start fucking with that more? Yeah, that's me. None of that drill, drill beats now. Nah. 
So, is there any like Jersey drill beats art? Like, is there any like Jersey or Philly artists that you want to work with? Like, did people start reaching out? I ain't gonna lie, I be burnt out. I don't be looking at her, my <laughs> DMs, girl. I be smacked. So, like, if someone wants to reach out to you for a collab, like, how should they go about that? You got a team? You got friends? I got my niggas with me, you feel me? That's all I need. So, are you um, managed by anyone? Are you solely independent? Mm -hmm. Stay independent. Okay. All right, his labels are calling, I'm sure. Yeah. What makes you, like, not want to sign yet? You feel like you want to drop more? Yeah, you scared, yeah. I only got a little bit of video, so. And keep up. Or is the numbers not right yet? Yeah, I need big numbers. <laughs> need big numbers. Okay, so like, um, so I feel like you was you was you was heavy on TikTok first, and I right? should got deleted, bro. Your TikTok got deleted. Gazed it three times, bro. So you like over TikTok? Word, bro, I'm done with that shit, bro. But TikTok was helping the song, no? Nah, it was. I'm done with that shit, bro. I should got deleted. So um, so. TikTok is done, but it's still on Instagram. Your YouTube channel is still going up. That's a fact. So you know how like upcoming artists kind of like drop on like raps and hustles and things like that. Are you like not gonna do that no more? Never. Do you feel like that helped? Yeah, they did. I ain't gonna lie, they did. You feel me? I don't need them niggas no more. So okay, so Move Look was Move Look was on Raps and Hustles, right? Mm -hmm. And that was the collab you did with Blackwork, which I no longer cool, right? Probably. Okay, so like, um, so like, do you have like regrets of like putting him on that song or yeah, like? Yeah, yeah. I should have did that shit Dolly gangster. Cause a lot of people liked it with just you on. Or I should do that shit Dolly and they kept begging me and shit. I should do that shit Dolly. So like, are you some more skeptical about who you do collabs with now? Yeah. So like, the homies gotta be. Only my niggas, my real rights. Only yours for sure. Mm -hmm. So definitely watching who you doing songs with. Word. Lately, but in your songs a lot, fans always say you mention Bree Bree and. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> so oh, man. what's that about? I ain't gonna lie, Bree Bree no good. <laughs> Bree Bree no good. Is that like an ex girlfriend or something or nah, that's that some... bitch, like bad kill? I ain't gonna lie, that <laughs> bitch, that bitch gotta drink some more water. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Yo, son. So like, will you like? Oh my God, this, I don't even know to say that. <laughs> I don't even know what to say to that. Break, break. So like, so, oh wow. So on behalf of like, I, I don't know. And Bree, don't be mad at me. We're against bro. I'm gonna say, dude, she, like, she hear your music and be mad. Thing. Does she like fess you up every time you drop? Like, how does that even go? She blocked me, you heard. So I know she's still watching me. So is that so that was a bad kill? Y'all was never like fucking around. That was just a bad kill. Bad kill. And then who was what about TT or Tati or uh, Tati, I go like Tati shit was alright. Tati shit was alright, though hello eyes. So and so if you fuck with a girl, she gotta expect her name to possibly be in a song? Or that just would be for fun. I just be I ain't talk my shit for me. You need to talk my shit, talk box. She jacking it too. So. so, so they fucking with your music for real. For real. Mm -hmm. So, so nobody really knows who the Tati person is, or your your, your friends know, your man's know. So I don't know who my brother <laughs> knows who Tati is. Okay. <laughs> so, so you think um, so if she if she ever made a song like back to you, like you jack it or you not jacking it? I respect it. You respect it. So if she hop in the booth today, you gonna jack it? Mm -hmm. That's what's up. <laughs> so your brother's rapping now. That's it's more, it's more, a lot of Mr. more. Mr. Oh shit, oh shit. <laughs> yeah, y'all are well known for y'all ad libs. Y'all got like, what the fuck? Oh shit, move look. Like, how how does the whole ad lib thing go? I ain't gonna lie, I be in my mode. You heard, gangster. Heard, but I'm not the, I'm not, I'm not like these other niggas, bro. Gangster, I'm different, bro. Gangster, I'm a Harlem nigga. I'm different. So. Oh, so what is it? What is it about Harlem that makes? Well, what is it about you that you feel like makes you different from everyone else? I'm not from the Bronx. You see, saying I'm from the Bronx, I'm not from the Bronx. Yeah, I just accent. live in the Bronx. That's yeah. it. So you live in the Bronx, but you're not from the Bronx. Not from the Bronx. And then like, um, 
a lot of a lot of like your fans say like when it comes to like bars like you kind of use a lot of the same Listen. lyrics and stuff. My shit's catchy. You what are your response me? to that? Listen, they jagging my shit. My, my numbers going up. Listen, <laughs> see what they want. So you don't. I, I get paid for this shit. You heard? So you don't really care what fans say. Don't. You're making music for fun. Yeah. For for real. Mm -hmm. Okay. So like um so do you have anybody that you want to collab with? On some mainstream wise, we know not Cardi B, but <laughs> anybody else? Nikki, you do a song with Nikki? Yeah, I do a song with. Who else? like um any other artists? No. No, like Drake, Future, Uzi, none of those. Only Young Boy. Young Boy. Yeah. People say that y'all look alike too. Do people do that get do that, does that bother when people be like oh y'all look alike? Yeah, everybody say that shit. And what's your response to like people saying that? I don't know. <laughs> Seen them. And then um, everybody thought that you had got shot in your head or something. Never got like shot that. in my head. Please. And you clear I'm that up. I see that shit every <laughs> song. Like, every song, bro. Instant. So do you know how that rumor came about? Politics, bro. Niggas don't want to talk about what happened to that man. No. <laughs> yeah, please don't get in trouble. Yeah, okay, Talk so yeah, but that was a rumor that definitely did not happen. Never. So um, so so you and E Dot and Shaw still tight, right? And will y'all ever do like a joint project or more music or? Mm. I don't know. You heard gangsta for me. I, I move. I move. I move the way I move. You heard niggas. Move. Cause I seen that um Lil TJ had posted like oh we would love to see like a. Bro, that's weird for me. I'm not, I'm not jogging that. Sheesh. TJ had made a post about how he wanted to see like K, Doug, Shy, and B Love on the track together, and you was like I fuck with who fuck with me, that's or something like that. So like. <clears throat> so. I don't pick sides, you heard, gangster. Once it's up, it's up. No that no being friends, none of that. So you don't think you would ever resolve beef for any apps? It's quiet. Okay. Especially them niggas. So so what about the girls that be like chilling with apps? They a dub too? Or it's like Yeah, they yeah, they shot too. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so um so like so so I wanna say like do you feel like that's gonna affect money in the future? Like like show money and stuff like that. No. Future. Money first, you heard gangster. Okay. Fuck all other shit. Okay, but you just say you know you wouldn't debut for your app. So it's yeah, like but for, me? for the right price you would or never ever. Never talk about that. You say you don't know how you feel about that? Never talk about that. Okay. Okay. That's fair. So <clears throat> So what you working on next? Are you gonna give us a project soon? Are you gonna? Are is you and your brother gonna be like a dynamic duo? I yeah. see y'all just dropped the Evil Twins. Yeah, that's, a fact. that's at like two hundred k right now. Yeah. And then like yeah. what? Three days? Two days? Yeah. Uh, we about to go crazy, gangster. So um, so like, how did so you got him into the booth, or y'all been was working on that, or? Nah, he got himself in the booth. Yeah, so like, so you got in the song ASAP, like once he started rapping, you was like, oh, it's lit? Yeah. Okay. After the song, man, we got, we got a couple of songs too, you feel me? Okay. Yeah. All right, so you got you and your brother now. Um, So you, so are you looking to sign a deal or you want to stay independent? You say you want to stay independent a little bit longer? Yeah. What is it you looking for in a deal? Is it like only numbers or you want like, you want to travel more? You want to... Now, I'm straight independent. And then, like, at the time, like, your music was going up, you had got locked up or whatever. Do you feel like, like, Hip Hop Police is super on on the artist right now? Yeah. And, like, how do you plan to stay, I guess, out of trouble this summer? <laughs> stay out the way, you heard. That's it. And drop and post and all the oh, videos man, and stuff like that. Fans, that's it. And like, um, who was I guess I want to say your biggest supporter? Like when the music started going up, who was like been supporting you like from day one? 
My niggas. My block and shit. Mm -hmm. So, like, when you get your first big bag, like, what's the plan? You want to leave the city or you want to stay in the towns or family or house? Like, first, I'm going to get my mom a crib. Then, I mean, I'm, I'm going to be in the hood, though, you heard? Me and my niggas, me and my niggas going to be in the trip for me. We're going to be doing shit. Like so would you um would you stay in New York or you would go to like Atlanta or some shit? Nah, I, I get a little crib out, out there, son. Out where? I can't tell you that. Oh, but you definitely gonna leave the city that's when right. when that bread come in. Okay. That's okay, that's fair. You got like? You gotta like the little things, But um, so you have a project coming soon, do you? Or not yet? Or maybe? Soon, soon. So only have a title yet? Smoking on bad too. That is not gonna be the name of your project. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, but before the summer? No. Maybe during summer? Yeah. During the summer. And then um well you're gonna have your brother on of course. Any surprise collabs? Has any celebrities been like reaching out to y'all? Well to you? No. I be I ain't gonna lie, I'ma say it again, you heard I be so high, you heard I don't be looking at my DMs like that. So is that a good thing or a it's bad, bad thing? thing? I'm a, I'm a, I am a, I'm a funky blunt. <laughs> That's a bad thing, but you're going to have somebody on that? Like a manager, maybe? Oh, uh, no. Nah. You're going to get on that? Mm -hmm. Checking your DMs and stuff? Yeah, I'm going to get on that again. Sure. All right, mm -hmm. so what should people look forward to? Keep watching me. All right, and tell people to find you. How can they tune in? Check it out, King, man, on YouTube. Move low. Know what's going on. Smoking all day. Suck my dick.